we are going to take a closer look at what comes with the controller. Right here we have the handle grips, which are very inappropriately shaped. These are kind of cheap. And they just seem like the cheapest thing that they could shove in the package. This is the brand on them. And there's no model number or anything. And this was the number on the package. This is your throttle. Okay. The whole handle spins. You have a triple setting here. Off, one, and two. I'm assuming that's going to count for forward and backwards. All right. And the whole handle spins. I don't know why it has to be burnt orange. Nobody's bike is burnt orange. So that's going to match with absolutely nobody. Anyways. So here is the pins, which are not in a connector. Which leads us over to this area and that is they give you a million of these little rubber deals and those rubber deals are supposed to help you wire these connectors there's three connectors three faces for the connectors and a seal for one of them those connectors line up with the connectors here and you have to follow the wiring diagram provided on this QR code site right there it comes on this card to get the wiring diagram now if you lost yours take a picture of that got it so we're gonna move over to this guy right here a green fuse I believe it says 10 watt 1 kg kilojoule so and I believe these are diodes one-way diodes and the red and the white tape is probably significant for which direction I'm just guessing off the top of my head right now and these are the pins there's two rows of pins be careful don't break them don't lose them because I don't know if this is exact amount of pins you need but these are the female and these are the male so what also is included is a USB to serial converter which is just some cheapy thing in the original packaging here and then that hooks up to your serial to controller converter which is this little pinned out one here which then connects to this black one here now that's just pretty obvious observations so if we move over to the controller itself this controller came with mine is a kelly qsk ls 7275h and that's what the box said as well we have u b plus n c v b negative and w uh, we have a 24 through 72 volts, but if I'm not mistaken, the spec sheet says this goes up to about 90. And we're going to have to just grab from the website on that QR code for the wiring diagram. Now, what's significant about this guy right here, you can use this to program this from your computer. And apparently you can control all sorts of stuff, including your throttle response and so on, which I'll be going through in the future as I do front to back installation of everything. So thank you for watching the unboxing video. If you want to check out more, I'll be live streaming this as I do it. And this video will be coming out soon. A hybrid Ninja 300 gasoline and electric. Thank you for watching. We'll see you next time. Ciao.